Thierry Mado, there are some old street and old stuff, and of course, the old traditional culture. From what I can see, they do highly praise the value of traditional art and craft. And speaking of which, let's get going and to explore this beautiful place, okay? The Zongye Art and Cultural Center is the former headquarter of Meiji Sugar Company Limited, built in 1911. In 2001, the Cultural Affairs Bureau of China City Government established the Zongye Art and Cultural Center here. The site consists of four historical buildings where exhibitions are presented. While on the vase long, a variety of performances are staged. Once served as a guest house, this is a rare two-story Japanese building in Taiwan. On the first floor of the guest house, there are toy blocks with more ties and tenon joints that can be enjoyed by all ages. No nails or screws will be used to build these blocks, which allows visitors to experience the ancient Japanese building technique. Okay, the last one! ta -da, I finished it! So do you think that this is a fun place to come? Do you like this place? This giant piece of artwork was created by a Japanese artist named Takahito Kimula and is currently on display during the 2019 Mado Sugar Industry Art Triennial inside the Red House. Using the cyanotype process, the artist invited logos in Mado to participate in his project in order to create this massive piece of artwork. The Zongye Art and Cultural Center invites artists from Taiwan and from overseas. They are welcome to experience the local culture of Ma Do and get some inspiration for their artworks. As you can see here, there are many scripts written by local people and the artists who participate in the exhibition try to tell us the story of Ma Do as well as the story of the old sugar factory. There are several things that should be taken into consideration when building a sugar factory. The quality of water is essential. The Zhengwen River had played a critical role in the development of the sugar industry in this area. Even though the sugar factory is not in operation anymore, the site remained and it transformed into a place full of history and culture. There are a lot of videos here that tells you more about this place, many many of them. If you would like to find out more, make a trip to the Zongye Art and Culture Center yourself. <laughs>